What is going on ladies and genitals, Yodi Slay here, bringing you episode 21 of my Borderlands 2 Legendary Weapons Guide. Today, I have an RPG known as the Bunny. In my case, it is the Bonus Bunny. In your case, the prefix of this RPG will change, but it will be some variation of the Bunny. Now, if you take a look at mine, the level requirement is only 49. I did not have a level 50 version of this. I assure you, they are out there. Uh, but to get this beast... Uh, it's not like your typical legendaries where you go and farm one certain guy. You get these from killing chubby enemies. Now, the best place that I have found is, is in the Caustic Caverns for sure, but you can also find these in the Tundra Express as well as anywhere in Pandora, but these two are like the best place to get these to spawn. Now, if you take a look here at Caustic Caverns, Right here at the, in the green circle, right outside the spawn, is a good place where there's two dump trucks. And over here to the left in the red circle, there's also two more dump trucks. Um, you got to get them from, in my case, it was a Varkid that spawned in as a chubby. And we actually were farming for Vermivorous when we did this. That's why it's all hectic. But there you can see there is a chubby Varkid. I do go down a couple times, but... If you've been, if you've formed Vimivorous at all, you do know that you get your, your ace handed to you just a, a couple times during the process. Uh, and in my case, the Chubby Varkid did spawn out. And you can see there, he does drop the bonus bunny for me. Now, I will say that I've not killed many Chubbies in this game. Um, I've never really tried to farm for these things because I wasn't really sure where to go to get them. Um... I've not killed very many, and I got this bunny right here pretty quickly after we started farming for Vermivorous. Man, that's a tongue twister for me. And also, like 10 minutes after getting this right here, he also drops the shield Whiskey Tango Foxtrot. I got that from another chubby 10 minutes after getting this bunny. So it seems to me like legendary drops from the chubbies might be pretty, uh, pretty popular. It might not be too hard to get. So... Cross your nuts and your fingers. Hopefully, you guys can get them as easily as what I did with these chubbies here. Now, we're taking a look at the gameplay here. I don't have the beast shield on or anything like that. I don't think that really gives you any kind of bonus damage for the RPGs. But you've seen there right when I reloaded. There it is. That is what the bunny does. It's, you've seen at the beginning, it said like hippity hippity in the red text. What it does is you are normally got three shots with them. But because my Macromancer, I've got in my skill tree to where it decreases your magazine size. I've only got two. Uh, but you shoot those. It does some work. I, mine's a slag version. But when you reload this beast, it like throws it out and it like hops across the ground like a bunny rabbit. That's where the, the name bunny comes from, I'm assuming. Uh, but I don't know. I think it's a pretty cool RPG. It's pretty fun to use just because, you know, you throw and it goes bouncing across the ground. And it'll bounce for a while, dudes. It'll go for a while. In my case, there's a lot of enemies like right up in my grill. So it doesn't go like all the way across the map. But, you know, I played around with it when we were farming for Vermivorous that night. I was actually using it just because I was, I was glad I finally got a legendary. I went through like a stall point where I wasn't getting any legendaries. I've got like 40 of these legendaries and like... I'm in a dry spell. I cannot get legendaries to save my life right now. There's only around 50 legendaries, okay? I got like 40 of them within a week. Like, I was just busting out legendaries. I end up getting my Macromancer DLC, getting that rare loot relic, and it seems like that jinxed me, and I quit getting leg legendaries. I actually started this Macromancer uh, character just to have a fresh character because I thought maybe I had reached the max on my siren and it just wasn't going to give me any more because I had so many. So that's one of the reasons why I went with this Macromancer. Got all the way to 2.5 playthrough and started playing with that. Uh, but yeah, we got the bunny. We got the Whiskey Tango Foxtrot. Uh, in that same night, within like from the beginning to end... Um, we started farming Vermivorous. Like 10 minutes in, we got this bunny here. Then like 10 minutes after that, we got the Whiskey Tango Foxtrot from another Chubby. The Chubbies dropped two legendaries. The Shield, Whiskey Tango Foxtrot, or the Bunny. Uh, so yeah, good luck on farming these bunnies, dudes. Or not the bunnies, the Chubbies. Like I said, Caustic Caverns or in the Tundra Express. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy this. I am out of here. Peace.